Hello, in this session I will talk about how Amazon, Yahoo and Google are using big data. This is Hassan Mir from 02protraining.com. In the previous session we looked into not only it's important to know what big data is, but also it's important to find out what value you want to derive from the big data. So let's take a look at how Google, Facebook and Amazon are using big data to create marketing schemes and also as a means of servicing their customers better. So what is the end game for big data for Amazon? They want to reach a recommendation for their customers on which products they should be buying. They do have a massive amount of data at their disposal. So what does this data include? Customers searches, their past purchases, and also other information like where customer is located, what customer has been doing on social networking, etc. So they make use of all this information to their advantage. Having access to all this data is one thing and doing analysis is another. So then Amazon apply algorithms to this huge amount of data and they compare one customer's information with the other. After applying these complex algorithms, they reach the recommendation on what customers should be buying. So Amazon has learned to derive value from the big data. So the aftermath of their big data number crunching is they reach measurable results. That's very important to offer advantage to your customers. So Amazon would be able to do recommendation. Let's say customer A has logged in after doing these complex analysis on the big data Amazon would be able to recommend book one to the customer A and let's say customer A has purchased a product let, let's say a jacket a customer would then see more recommendations from Amazon based on the area in which customer lives in based on the weather based on the trend and based on other information let's say customer would be recommended to buy gloves as well now let's talk about Facebook being a social networking site, they have access to large amount of data. Again, having access is one thing, knowing what to do with that is another thing. The way Facebook is using the big data is to do friend suggestions, to do target advertisements and to do member focused offerings. So what do they have in their big data? They have user activities, their past activities, their current activities, whatever they're doing on the Facebook. They have other users activity as well so that they can do the comparison and they have access to other information like user preferences and other public data just like Amazon they also apply complex algorithms to perform pattern recognitions and as a result they are able to achieve their objectives again Facebook has learned to derive value from the big data and based on the reviews you can see that their recommendations are pretty accurate. Now let's talk about Google. Google is actually the originator of the software elements that make big data crunching possible. You can check my video that I have created on history of Hadoop, how the technology went from Google to Yahoo and from Yahoo to Apache. And the technology is called Hadoop and which is used by most companies including Facebook to do number crunching on big data. There are other tools available as well. Now let's come back to Google. Compared to Amazon and Facebook, Google uses big data to its fullest extent possible. So what value Google derives from the big data? They want to judge search results, they want to predict internet traffic usage, they want to display relevant advertisement and they want to service customers with their Google applications. Being the most popular search company since a long time, Google has access to enormous data as well including web search information, users preferences, cookies and activity histories and so on. Then complex algorithms are applied to the big data to reach meaningful information to meet their objectives.